I also, I'm very intrigued. I want to know what you got to say about this. Yeah. Why do you have so many baby daddies? I have so many baby daddies because number one, I'm very fucking fertile. That <laughs> <laughs> we know. Let's just start there. I don't believe in hoarding human beings in my life when your time has expired in my life onto the next. But I'm not going to slow down the plans I have for my life because I'm not working out with one guy. Guys, I'm not going to be There's so many men. If I have an award from YFM for radio and my relationship with YFM doesn't work out, I'm not going to go to Metro FM and not try to get an award. Yeah. You understand? Oh. So by the time I get to Kaya FM, I would have had an award from YFM, an award from Metro FM, an award from Kaya FM. So that's how I look at my life, right? My children are the award that I got from a failed relationship. Ooh. And they oh. make my life okay. Yeah. So society has a tendency to say, yeah, your value has gone down. No, I've got a line of guys wanting to be with me. Guys, the value is up. The price has gone up. What's good, y'all? Shout out to the notification gang for hitting the like button and the video we didn't even start yet. Y'all know this one's in it. I appreciate you anyway. Yeah, man. I mean, a, 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 a whole no, a whole another minute, man, of, of of straight damn delusion from 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 this woman, man. Listen, I, I I don't I don't get. Well, I think I believe I get it, but um, for a lot of the women that refuses to understand where they are in a dating market, in a dating world, it, it's, it's so baffling, man. It's, it's to the point where it's just like, yo, I don't even care to talk about these types of topics anymore because you hear this all the damn time. First of all, if y'all know who this is, let me know. Put it in the comment section. From what I've been hearing, uh, I'm sorry, I read, uh, hearing. From what I was reading in the comment section, apparently she has uh, multiple kids. She has three baby daddies, apparently. I don't know how many kids she has, but they were saying she has three baby daddies. Um... Or, or whatever the case may be. So they were asking her, like, yo, why do you have so many baby daddies? And so she was like, oh, well, this, that, and the third, da, 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 whatever, whatever. And then towards the end, she says, yo, my the value is up, the price is up, and this, that, and the third. I have a line of guys that's, trying, that's waiting to get with me. One of my favorite things that women say, oh, I got, I, got a million, I got a million guys in my inbox. I got a million guys in my DMs. I got a million guys that's trying to get with me. But ladies, what I've been saying since day one, how many of those guys are actually here to get, to, to marry you, treat you with respect, be a husband to you, a father figure to your damn however many kids you have from three different men? How many of those guys are trying to do that? Because I can almost guarantee you 99% of those guys is in your DMs, in your inbox, or your, what she say, line of men. 99% of the men that's in line waiting to get with you I guarantee you they just trying to smash and once they smash they're gonna keep moving or they may just just you know stretch it out i used to do that with, with, with chicks um that, that i used to talk to i used to do that i do i used to be sitting there like bro ain't nothing for that happen with, with, with me and you but hey yo you know what this head fire so i'm gonna stick around a little bit facts in the dating world we have in the dating market where our price is set for men our price is set depending on what we bring to the table as far as education sometimes, as far as finances, which is like the main one, the type of car you're driving, do you have your own place? Uh, do you have an apartment? Do you own? Are you renting? Are you mortgage? Are you this? Are you that? Are you da 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 That's for men. That is for men. For women, I've said this too many goddamn times. I've said this in what what what, is, what did I say this in? Um, the prime years between um, you know prime years and difference between men and women. I'll make sure to put the I at the top if I remember. Um, for women, your price is set in a market in a dating market based on your youth. Are you in shape? Are you fit? Do you look good? Your your, your, your face, your cuteness. If you don't have kids, if you have kids, it kind of drops you down lower. And that's just the way it is. That is just the way it is. How do we know this? Because you hear this from majority of men, but women for whatever, a lot of women for whatever reason is constantly in denial about these types of things. Constantly in denial about these types of things. And they never want to listen to the men. The men is the one that you want, ladies. So you should be listening to men. Not other goddamn single women. On about how to get and keep a damn man. Listen to what the men are saying. Men are saying we want a woman that's fit. We want a woman that's, or, or not even fit, so, somewhat fit. 
You ain't got to be out here six-pack abs and toned up and veins. No, I don't, I don't want none of that. But at least be fit. Be in some type of shape. Keep your weight down under 160, 170 for me. I understand that, you know, you, you get pregnant, you, you gain weight and all this, that, and third. Okay, cool, you have that window time. But after that, you can lose the weight. I've seen people go from 280, 290, 320 damn pounds and lose over 100 pounds. So if they can do it and you only 220, you can lose 50 pounds. It's not that hard. It takes damn discipline. But a lot of people now is lazy. That's the difference. So what do they do, fellas? What do they do? They, they go get the breast implants. They go get the ass shots, the BBLs, the lips injections, the uh, tummy tucks, and all the other stupid-ass plastic surgery. Forgetting the fact that, hey, listen, if I'm used to eating, right, for example, if I'm used to eating three plates of food, and then I go get a tummy tuck and all this, that, and a third, I, I, I'm going I'm to be able to lose weight and keep the weight down. No, you did that overnight. Mentally and technically physically your anatomy is still dependent on you eating three plates a goddamn night So what are you gonna do? You're gonna gain the damn weight back. I've seen it happen so many damn times So many damn times Where people will sit here and go through these uh, a lot of women that will sit here and do these stupid ass damn plastic surgeries And then gain the weight back what was the point of you spending thousands of dollars on all that other crap if you're going to gain it back anyway? That doesn't make sense to me. So that's why when these types of videos comes out, and these men, and I, I there's people in the comments that tell me, oh, they're being disrespectful, asking why she got some baby that. I don't think that's being disrespectful. I think that's a genuine damn question. I don't think that's disrespectful. I think that was a genuine ass question. Those are the type of questions I'll be asking. Like, like if I, well, if I wouldn't be dating a chick that got three baby daddies, number one. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But if I was, those are the, like, why you got so many damn baby, why, why, why you ain't settled down with one of them damn baby daddies? Why you ain't settled, why, why didn't it work out between y'all two? I need a detailed explanation. If you can't get that to me, it's a wrap. All right, cool, I'm out. Goodbye, have a good day. I wish you the best. That's it. I get it that you guys want to sit here and make up whatever type of excuse to try to make it seem like, oh, it's okay, and oh, this, that, and the third, hollering about, oh, well, you know, my, I, I left my bad relationship, but I was blessed with my kids, and I was this, that, and the third, da, 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 da. You were blessed, but your kids wasn't. I still believe that a child needs a mother and a father in their life, a two-parent household. I still believe that, and I still believe that any woman that sits there and know for a fact it's not going to work out between her and a damn baby daddy, and you decide to go full term, you decide to be a goddamn single mother, raise these damn kids, I still believe those are for selfish reasons, selfish intentions, and I'm going to keep preaching that. I don't like, especially in our community, black women that do stuff like that. I've had homegirls who literally found out they was three, four weeks pregnant, knowing they wasn't going to work out between a damn baby daddy, and still kept the child. Oh, well, I want a child, so I'm going to keep it. Selfishness. Just being selfish. So to this woman, again, if y'all know who she is, put her, put her, put her name in the comment section. Um, so so, so to, to, the, to this damn woman, man, I hope that I hope that she finds what she's looking for. She might be that woman that, that, that's in the low percent, like, like Sierra, that's actually able to get the man of her dreams. But we all know that is extremely highly unlikely. We all know that's extremely highly unlikely. More than likely, she'll probably bounce. She'll probably either have, get two more baby daddies before she calls and quits and all this, that, and third. Y'all, y'all know how y'all know how this story goes. Unfortunately, man. Um. Anyway, man. Uh, let let me know what y'all think about this video, man. Thanks for watching. Please, 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 if you haven't hit that subscribe button, man. Also, too, hit that bell symbol on size. So anytime I make an upload, notification will pop up and alert you. Also, too, make sure y'all hit that like. Make sure y'all hit that share. I look forward to reading all y'all comments, if any. So, until next time. Please, man, y'all be safe for her, cuz. Also, I'm very intrigued. I want to know what you got to say about this. Yeah. Why do you have so many baby daddies? 
I have so many baby daddies because number one, I'm very fucking fertile. <laughs> <laughs> that we know. Let's just start there. I don't believe in hoarding human beings in my life when your time has expired in my life onto the next. But I'm not going to slow down the plans I have for my life because I'm not working out with one guy. Guys, I'm not going to be there's so many men. If I have an award from YFM for radio and my relationship with YFM doesn't work out, I'm not going to go to Metro FM and not try to get an award. Yeah. You understand? Oh. So by the time I get to Kaya FM, I would have had an award from YFM, an award from Metro FM, an award from Kaya FM. So that's how I look at my life, right? My children are the awards that I got from a failed relationship. Ooh. And they oh. make my life okay. Yeah. So society has a tendency to say, yeah, your value has gone down. No, I've got a line of guys wanting to be with me. Guys, the value is up. The price has gone up.